Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to install Lightroom presets for desktop and laptop versions of Lightroom. So when you download Lightroom presets, they come in a zip archive, so first we need to unzip or unpack the files inside. It's a little different on each computer, but it's very similar across platforms. So I'm going to right click my zip file and you want to look for something that says extract files, unzip, or decompress, or something like that. I'm using 7-Zip on Windows, so I'm going to come into the 7-Zip menu and choose Extract here. You'll see that I have a new folder, and that used to be a folder inside the zip file. So I'm going to go into that folder, and we're installing the desktop preset, so I'm going to go into the desktop folder. Older versions of Lightroom use .lr template files, while newer versions use .xmp files. So if your download contains multiple folders, make sure you're using the right file type for your version of Lightroom. So I'll come into the CC 2016 and newer folder, and this is the folder that contains all of our preset files. If I go into this folder, you'll see a whole bunch of .xmp files. Next, I'm going to come into Lightroom, and I'll click Edit, Preferences, and then I'll come over to the Presets tab. Now you want to come over and choose Show Lightroom Develop Presets. And that's going to open the folder where all your Lightroom presets are stored. Next you'll go into the Settings folder and this is where you're going to paste all of your Lightroom presets. So I'm going to select my Lightroom Presets folder and press Ctrl C to copy. And then I'll come back into the Settings folder and press Ctrl V to paste. Back in Lightroom, you then want to click Restart Lightroom or Restart Lightroom Classic. Once it restarts, you want to come over to your presets panel and you can now see that my Lightroom presets are installed. Now I'll click the little arrow to expand that folder. And as you hover over each preset, you'll see a preview on the main image. To apply a preset, all you have to do is give it a click. You can use presets as is or you can customize them to your liking. So if you come into the basic panel, you can increase or decrease the exposure till you're happy. Presets are also good because you can go into each panel and see what settings have been changed to give the effect that's been applied. If you don't currently have any Lightroom presets to work with, you can download some of our Lightroom presets for portraits, landscapes, and more at newlayer.com slash Lightroom presets. I'm JT Shaver for New Layer. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.